What's going on? This is the big Jew. Welcome back to Let's Play the Seventh Saga, No Magic Run. Take three. Oh, yeah, so, we haven't found the Sky Rune yet. Um, uh, pretty sure we won't find it for a while. But, uh, whatever, we'll just do some more exploring, maybe we'll find it in some other places. Now, in Pandam... In Pandam, they were saying that they get their stuff from Brush, which is to the northwest. And Brush is gonna be our next destination. So let's check our map there. You see that little, uh, peninsula right there? To the left? That's our destination. We wanna head there, so let's do that. Hope you liked my, uh, special episode there. It was more vlog than anything. I don't know why it turned out like that. Sorry, but whatever. Uh, it doesn't matter, really. It's over. Just a lot of stuff on my mind, I guess. Also, I've been using the, uh... I've been using the weekend to record, uh... Crystallis. I've got pretty much the whole game done. And yeah, I'm just gonna upload those. And we're gonna redo Zelda 2 and Dragon Warrior 4 and Dragon uh, Warrior 3. And we're gonna do different variations of those games. Uh, what else am I gonna redo? Final Fantasy. I'm gonna actually do a different one for that too. And look at me, I'm vlogging right now! Oh my god! Holy crap! Anyway, this is Brush. And they have some new armor here for Olven. And I'm not gonna get it right now, but I am gonna get this. The Mystic Armor increases your defense power by 12. Really good. So that is a defense rating of, what, 32, I guess? And the Mystic Shield, it's not anything better than the uh, uh, Kryn Shield or whatever it is. It is a lot less money, and it has, like, similar defense power, so I guess you, know, you could buy it if you want. By the way, the prices in Brush are also affected by whatever goes on in uh, Telling Belain, so... Make sure you take care of that. If you want the prices to go down. So yeah, let's talk to some of these people here, see what's going on. Brantu, huh? That's the guy from, uh, Zealous. And apparently this, uh, planet is, uh, half a billion years older than, uh, the Earth. 5.1 compared to 4.6 billion. So that's pretty cool, I guess. Yeah, no, Brantu, he... I had to, uh, escort him to Melanon. He's in his lab, which you're blocking. Ugh, oh, whatever. Just go over here. And hopefully that woman won't be in the way, because I want to talk to Brant2, Brant2, whatever his name is. Huh. Well, I mean, you know, mad scientist. It's usually how they always are. Really? Okay. Cool. Oh yeah, I had to use a different save. Ah, oh, what happened was I did this episode, it didn't record audio off Camp Studio, so I had to just go back and, you know, do everything. So I did, I had already talked to him. He says like, yeah, like, what he says before he just said there was... I'll say, yeah, thanks for showing me Melanom, it was really cool to see all that. I've been inspired by what was, uh, what I saw there, so I'm working on this project, and it's not finished yet. So we have to just come back later. Basically after we get all the runes. And he referred us to Rarsa, the fortune teller, so... Let's see... Go to Fauna, huh? Okay, let's go there. Alright then. Let's head over there. It costs a hundred dollars to, uh, get your fortune told. And, let's see. Tifana is a little bit to the right and up. Uh, so yeah, let's head over there right now. Wow, I just fought a super brain. That's pretty crazy. They're more... Oh god, I hate when enemies buff themselves. Holy crap. But yeah, super brains are more rare here than... God. Alright, enough. 
Hey, there we go. Oh, and there's a rune in Tifana, too. Could it be the Sky Rune? Let's hope so. Oh my god. That'd be awesome. Let me tell ya. Alright, first thing I wanna do is rest up here. I got hit pretty I got hurt pretty bad. Where the hell's the in? All the way over here. Wicked sorceress. Uh no. Why owns a guy? Random. Anyway. <laughs> well rested up. Uh let's see, I wanna look for the room first. Hell with anything else. Let's see where the apprentice could be in the armor shop. Hey, it's Lux. It probably is Lux. Let's see here. What the hell? What? Oh, okay. You want to fight then? Well, damn, he didn't have to go all tech talk on me. Anyway, yeah, Lux as a as an opponent, probably the easiest one. Uh, he has very low speed, so what you want to do is use a bottle of agility to make Wallum even faster. That'll I mean, he'll pretty much dodge everything. Now he will use uh, Thunder 3 on you if you're at this level, which can do uh, quite a bit of damage, especially to someone like Wild who doesn't have a lot of magic. So, yeah. Uh, I want to keep... I want to keep my hit points up first, because enemy apprentices will run out of magic, so... What I want to do is make him run out of magic points, this way all he does is just attack me, and then he'll be a piece of cake. I'll probably be able to kill him in one shot. But yeah, make sure you buff your player non-stop. I mean, buff his speed, buff his defense, buff his power. This way you can be pretty much unstoppable. And against enemies like Lux, it's really easy. Oh crap! Oh my god, yeah, see. Oh, and don't be shy about using recoveries either. That's what they're there for. We can always get more by fighting brains around hell, so don't worry about it. Damn it. Yeah, that Thunder 3 spell does a lot of damage, man. You want to keep on top of things, let me tell you. I'm just glad I'm not fighting Essena or Valsu. Oh, that was easy. And now our experience are our experience points are unbalanced again. Yay! I'll fix that off screen. And we got the Sky Rune! Amazing! The frustration is over. Good deal. I didn't know it'd be in Tifana, jeez. Usually it would be in different place. Usually it's in like Belling or Telling, but whatever. Let's see what items they have. Oh, they don't have hearts here. Uh. I do want to buy harps. I think Brush had them, but I don't know. I don't remember. Whatever. So I can see that. Nothing new. Okay, that's fine. I don't know if Tifana is affected by the uh, inflations and stuff from Bellin and Telly, but I really don't know, to be quite honest. I've I've never been to Tifana without doing uh, whatever I need to do in uh, Bellin and Telly and whatever, so. Oh, we have the Brave Armor, which. Increases your defense power by 4 over the Fire Cloak, but Mystic Armor is still the way to go, in my opinion. Okay, now let's talk to everybody here. Really? Huh. Uh, maybe she was uh, taken by the bad guy, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, this is Tafana, definitely. Alright. Oh, no way. That'd be really bad if the princess was named Tiffany. That would just be... I'd just be like, no, no, but whatever. Really? Serpent, huh? Hmm. Yeah, Polosu is to the north. I don't want to go there quite yet because the enemies there will kill you. 
Oh, and here's the castle. Okay. Wonder if it has treasures like in uh, Belly and Telly. Wow, that sucks. I guess the serpent is a uh, pretty tough. Let me tell you. Huh. Yeah, so I may as well do some exploring here. Oh, they have like little overlooks. That's pretty cool. Or whatever it is. Uh, balconies. Balconies. That's what it's called. Overlooks. What the hell's my problem? Anyway, whatever. Let's climb all the way up to the top. See if we can find some treasure. Nope, just a random soldier who is hoping for the safety of the princess. Whatever, buddy. I don't have much time, so I want to go see the king. And what I'm going to do between now and next episode, I want to get real quick what I'm going to... Ah. I want to get 100,000 XP for both my players by fighting Super Brains in a... What do you call it? Luze. Or B-Roar, or whatever it's called. So, yeah. Let's go see the king first before I, uh... Before I end this session. Where the hell is he? Oh crap, now I'm at 15 minutes. God damn it. What the hell? I didn't know there was a house of healing inside the castle. That's different. I guess. Oh, okay, there he is. Is this it? Or is this... No, it's another dead end. God damn it, I hate these castles, man. Okay, there we go. Whenever there's guards surrounding the door, you know that the king is there. Yeah, here he is. Alright. Sup, king? Sure, why not? Okay. So, next time on Let's Play the Seventh Saga, no magic run. I'm going to get 100,000 XP for both my players, and then we will find the Princess of Tifana, get our reward of $5,000. Cheap-ass king. This is the big Jew telling you to keep being awesome. Peace.